Well, welcome to HMS Forward. Well, this is an old Royal Navy base, HMS Forward, used what I believe the tail end of the war. Got some coming to the left. Oh, bloody hell. Tubers just know you've had a piddle. <laughs> Uh, I want to have a look in there. Yeah. Oh, don't step and pedal. Steve was here, 93. Yeah, they I try not to read too many out. They were the. Uh, did they go to the pill boxes? Yeah, I think that, that one's the one that don't go as far. I think that's the one that goes the furthest. Off you go. They're fun to come back down. Oh, you've been up them? I think you've got to go up for the tubers. Oh, well, we'll have a look at one. Oh, dear girl. You know when I said about the fellow who said to his mum? Yeah. He was here. Oh, was he? Yeah. Right, mum. Yeah, have you seen it? That, that used to be up by the entrance. Yeah. yeah. I wish I'd brought a floodlight with us now because. What, what did I say to you? Well, I thought this would be good enough, but I hope. I hope Trevers can see it, okay? Well, can I swap head torch with that for you for now so Tubers can get a better cock of what's going on, Will? There you go. Thank you, Mr. Williams. He's just made the video more easier for us. That's better, isn't it, Tubers? Oh, Barrow, eh? Go and have a little shifties then, Will. Shaft system. Always a beer can in these places. Generator room. We've got some information. No, I shouldn't thought you would get a signal under it. Evidently, it is damp down here. I've got a signal. I don't know how I'm scared. Help! What you bloody got to? Some 
incredible, isn't it? Yeah, you can't believe this. I wish I'd have brought the print out of the map. Well, oh, yeah. huh. how are you down there? I think this is, this is definitely the biggest underground bunker we've ever been in. Yeah. <coughs> this is awesome. It's quite clean and tidy, I. Yeah, but some of the depth of work's been done because this floor is pretty original, isn't it? This is all been done. I don't know. Oh yeah, it's just a sleeping compartment. Yeah, because friends of the tunnel owned it for a while. Yeah. Oh, lovely. I've got a feeling that's just going to connect the two tunnels together. I wonder if this is where they just tidied up and put things back, yeah, um, tidied it up and put things down, you yeah, know, swept it all into there. You're still in the main corridor? Yeah. I don't want to get too sidetracked, I think we should... John Monkey, how is it? 2018. I think what we want to do is just stick to the main corridor and then zigzag our way back. Yeah. The Lord is mum. Yeah. That's water, full of water there. Yeah. It's a shame that a group of people wanted to bring this back and obviously the houses above denied well, it. Well yeah, because they've obviously started doing it, isn't they? It's Why nice and clean. It? I am surprised it's in this good, good condition. Yeah, because I would have expected it to be more of that. I mean, a bit of chalk writing on the wall. I'm almost pleased to see the chalk graffiti because yeah. it beats stuff like that everywhere, Jim. Yeah. I'd rather the chalk, the chalk's than that, you know. Worse, that is what annoys me. Yeah, I don't like the spray on. I'm hoping you can't see that far in the future, Tudor. It's heading through to a room. Yeah, well, you can't just do... This door closes at 12 a.m. I like some staircases with me.
This is steep. Sorry if I'm not saying a lot, tubers. With a backfielded entrance or turret. Come on, out of breath. Dead end. Go have a look. I might take a picture when you're up there, down there, and I'm up here, using the light. Right. Oh, it's a workout. Are you out of breath? <laughs> oh, thank God for that. What? I was thinking I was high up in the Alps. Blimey. Goes up again. <laughs> I might possibly not go up the other steps. I thought it was in lovely condition. I wouldn't mind getting up close to those steps. Are we going up the other side? Yeah. Fuck okay, out, pack of ten cigarettes. <laughs> They've been there a while. Yeah. Richmond. I love these gates. Look at the angle of it, it makes you feel all good, doesn't it? Get a photo of that. You know, I've got the camera in the back pocket. Have you? Yeah. Get it. It takes pics. You're not unzipping together? Oh. So it's your phone, right? Yeah. Is it wrong to want to know whether this gate still opens and closes? That's right. Oh, it does. Huh. Fuck me, more stairs, Will. <coughs> There's been another gate there. Hello, there's a, some ladders, Will. More beer cats.
Oh, right, Jesus. It's a floodlight. Here's an urban explorer. Are you out of breath? Yeah. Thank God. <laughs> yeah, I'm out of breath as well. Don't be that nasty, eh? Makes me feel better than being this fit. Both fat fuckers. Well, probably find there's not a lot of good oxygen in here, to be fair. Oh, shit. Could do with another opening, couldn't it? Yeah. The steward will leave a link to his channel in the description, as I always have to do. Hold on. There you go. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> now I'm going to have to blur that out. No, you won't. Did I wipe? <laughs> Had I wiped? <laughs> You'll have to look at Mark's video for that tube. You like that? Oh, knackered. Yeah, it's always easy going down and he's going up. Yeah. Oh, in, in, yeah. In, a few years, this sort of thing will be like, oh, look at these people that were here, sort of yeah. thing. Yeah. Look at this. There's loads of them. There's some ones that say 1987. Wait, oh yeah? Yeah, no. Wouldn't surprise me. 79? Yeah. Sue Crudge was here, March 79. Me 13. I mean, I like this one, you know. Tony, he tiger. Chris was in. Chris, if you're watching, we were in. Yeah. Yeah. Take, have you taken some photos, proper photos? Yeah. Mark's still up in the turrets at the moment. Vertical plot, pre-D-Day. Well, the friends of the tunnel, HMS Forward. In, out, 73, what still here, 1988. This the year I was born. Yeah. 94. William, you didn't graffiti in, in 1994. Can't say I was. Hmm. I was here, man. And your brother, Ben, William, if there's an head on there, you've been here before. It's just an incredible experience. Standing in the footsteps of the men that were here, you know. Ren's mess. John Monk, yeah, I've been doing that one. It's a shame that Friends of the Tunnel gave up. Anyway, we're going to bring you back in a bit when we get to the top of those uh, slopes. Uh -huh. uh, there's the return problem. It's that slope, that's steep. I'll put it in pocket. It's not easy, is it? It's exploring, Lark, it's dangerous. <laughs> Mr. Williams, a lot faster than me. But as we've said in previous videos, it's not about who does what fastest, it's about going at your own comfort. He's off again. Seriously, another one? Are you 
you're going to attempt to go up that one. Yep. Oh, we'll wait here this time, tubers. Oh yeah. Yeah, Is that rubble coming down up the hatch? Yeah, that's wood there. Oh, there is a lot there. Well, we're getting rained on tubers. This is what we've also just battled up. Surely it wasn't slopes previously. Was it? There's Mark again. It's so, alright. Uh, are you going up there? No, but are you going up there? I can't see shit because of your torch. This is what happens when people come up with light. Light? No, Fuck me. Don't blind me with that little thing. I've seen arctic oh, lorries yeah. with fucking bright, <laughs> less bright lights. Yeah. You don't, want, you don't want people going, oh, I can't see the footage. I see you're dark. stood to one side nervously. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it's when people get to about there that they fall, so I hope, yeah. Well, Stuart didn't safe. fall, so that's... No, that's, too right. That's, that's quite I want to come down on my ass now. I want to slide down the camera's off. Hats off to you. <laughs> I would have slid on my ass like you don't know what. Yeah. Fuck I me, mean, what's this gimbal and all now? Yeah, mate. This is this is my Christmas present to Lauren. To Lauren? From Lauren. From Lauren? Yeah. In about 2004. My partner said to me she didn't know what she, she wanted me to choose for her birthday. Yeah. Well, if I choose, you're getting a fucking Canon Airfield for a 1.2 Vauxhall Nova. <laughs> no, you won't. No, you won't. <laughs> yeah, <coughs> November the 5th came round her birthday. <laughs> K and an airfield for a Vauxhall Nova. Yeah. And I'm still know. recording, aren't I? <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, well, that can Actually, stay. That's the first time I've ever seen you use your GoPro since you've had it for all these months. It's just so much more convenient with the phone, as you know. Look. I don't even know if this is pointed right, tubers. No, I think you'll find all your footage is going to be up in the air. Does it look that way? I know from, I know, I know from past experience. Is that probably a better angle? That's probably a bit too much. Yeah, I'll look. Where, can you see above my head? Am I looking at Mark or his crotch? You pretty much centre. It needs to go a little bit to your right. Fractionally. Yeah, that's cool. Where am I looking at on his body? Nearly got his head in. You can see his knees. Nearly got his. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's good enough, Windows. Oh, I wouldn't let. I wouldn't let your. Uh, Are you going up there? Your subscribers who say that's good enough. That'd be good enough. They don't want that's good enough. They want perfect. Well, get up there and slide down on your ass, and they'll have a perfect <laughs> ending to this video, won't well, they? I don't do things like that. No, I don't. I, don't I played it so. Oh, go on. You might as well. Come mark on. Up your run. Go on, Mark, and I'll get nine 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 on the ready. I can't go up there with a whiskey. Oh, well, I'll yeah, film it for your you channel. My gimbal. I'll, I'll take your my flashlight and point it gimbal. in your eyes. Come on, up you go. I've been up there, I know what's up. Here are Tubers, Urban Explorers UK are a bunch of wimps. You they won't go out there. This is the fifth time I've been here, right? They don't know that. Well, they do now. Don't go to his channel and subscribe because he's a girly, <laughs> worthy channel. Um, didn't he say something at the beginning of the video? Let's have a quick flashback. Oh, you've been up them? I think you've got to go up for the tubers. Oh, well, we'll have a look at one. Oh, Don't be a girl. You know when I sit back the fence? Now who's being the girl? <laughs> what you can't see is he's got his fucking toenails painted pink. I have not. He, he doesn't like to break, but he did build an extra 200 metres of tunnel in there, didn't you? Yeah. Last no. time he came up Just here. for you. Yeah. yeah. It looked like last time he was in here, he laid a cable yeah. down the other end. The thing is, now I'm, I'm going to have a cigarette and guess who isn't having one. <laughs> <laughs> you won't make me beg on my own channel. <laughs> my hands are too filthy to roll. I'll be smoking bloody iron. That size quite big. 
What bigger than that side? I think so. That side's one one of the one of the shafts has got rubble all down it. Does it go up again up. or? Yeah. That's easy to go. Come back up. I got there. Yeah. Come on then. Oh, like I got that. Yeah. You go first. What bad leg? Oh bloody! I'll be up there on my own. What do you mean you've got a bad leg? <laughs> I'm okay. No, it's a constant temperature underground. Yeah. Some wellies. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you can see up there, Chiba. Ain't worth going up that one. Did you go up there? Yeah, it's quite easy to get up one. Yeah, but it's not going to be a lot to see, is there? Authentic lost wellies. Lost wellies, yeah. Someone's looking for them. You didn't go up? No, I didn't go up this time. Well, up we go. Oh, because it ain't worth going up, look. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Car tyres. There's a tyre down there. And another wooden ladder. What's left of it? Yeah. That well, tubers. All that concrete's been chucked in from the top. Yeah. Well, tubers. That's it for this video. That's been a fantastic explore. It has. It'd be interesting to come back maybe in 10, 15 years. And uh, it'd be good to come back in 10, 15 years and take another look really, wouldn't it? It would. You know, you can see that's not rotted, the frame it's just got surface rust. Yeah, that'll still be good another 50 years. It's amazingly solid really. See how damp it is. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed the video. It's probably been slow in places. We haven't said a great deal because we're taking it in. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click on the famous outro. Two bag. It's not over there. It's team. Oh, well. well, we're back because Mark would like to tell you guys a little bit about HMS Forward. He's frightened I didn't. It, it, it's story time with, with, with Mark. This might not cut... <laughs> this might not cut the uh, final edit, because it sounds like someone spilled someone's cup of tea over coming up. Yeah, they did. It was, huh? That's what started the war. <laughs> that's what started the Second World War. One was German and one was English. It all kicked no, off no, after that it, tea. It was involved in a big part of the D-Day landings, wasn't it? it was, this was, yeah. yeah it was head, head on communications. Yeah. During so it had all the Am I right in thinking this place was more towards the end of the war? No. It's not going to last another five minutes. <laughs> I believe so, yeah. Because they were going to open it up back in the 90s. That's right. Or was it early noughties? I thought I read early noughties there. Um, the 90s. Friends of the Tunnel. Yeah, it was in the 90s, I think. Yeah. They were going to. Hence why you've got all them little, uh, there's not one here, I think there's one behind you. So Wren's quarters, WT yeah. office. Yeah. I didn't notice one for the pan. You didn't notice one for the pan? Yeah. The toilet. What do you need to go? No. Do you need to make? No. <laughs> <laughs> I dropped one after you. <laughs> so yeah, there, used to be, there used to be a big manor house up there. Used to be, there's not anymore. No, it's got about 70. Oh, of course, yes. Yeah, yeah. Houses on it now, but yeah, one. One one of the one of the tunnels went up to a fake chicken coop. Yep. 
which had a machine gun in. Uh, another one went into the house. Four heads. <laughs> yeah, another one went into the house, and a third one went into the grounds, just the garden, I think, which obviously had a sort of like pillbox sort of thing there. There was a couple of pillboxes, wasn't there? Is that where we've just been up to? Yeah. Well, when the story did the big house, uh, it was requisitioned and yeah, they, by the army. Yeah, they took it over. And then that's yeah. when they decided yeah. to dig below it. Yeah, they took it over. They knew, they what knew. year was that? Was this here previous to the war? Because it, the, what the passage I read was something about Guinness. I don't necessarily mean the drink, but you know, something. I agree, to do that as well. Yeah. Was there tunnels here already, no, maybe? No, previous so. to World War Two. No. So in part of this video, I did say I wish I'd have printed off the bit indoors because this is quite a big explore for. You know, unlike the RAC place where you just go down, oh look, there's yeah. that, there's this. Oh, there's oh, a lot, yeah. lot of history about this place. Yeah. This place was a big part of Well, intentions, I know the intentions changed because of originally the big manor house, that was going to just be a headquarters. Then they decided that they wanted uh, tunnels, but they wanted all the work to be secret and what was going on. Apparently that was to do with the RAF. And then it led on that it was like a, a main branch that controlled I think it was New Age. The English Channel, wasn't it, I read? Yeah, well, just, yeah, this sort of... Trolled the shipping like, lane as we know it today. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like Brighton, Southampton, uh, all the way through <coughs> that part of the coast. And this was like the, the main the main hub. Uh, yeah, pretty much controlled a lot of it. Yeah. I remember reading rightly as well, this was in communication with, with the ships that were doing the landing the troops. D-Day. Well, yeah. yeah. Forwarded commands. Dare I do it? I might put the subrit link in it this time round. I'm not totally against subrit, but I, in a couple of communications I've had, you just kind of feel, why have you bothered, you know, trying to communicate with them? I just find them a little bit awkward, you know. Yeah. They helped me out massively, actually, with something I planned with them. Yeah. Which I can't say on camera. Yeah. That's probably laying a cable in a cave somewhere now, Mark. It's not going to be quite a surprise. Well, I'm going to end that bit there and I'm going to link the outro because I want to now know. See you <laughs> next time. <laughs>